Hi guys, this is a follow-up video to one I did a couple of nights ago where I picked up a record collection from somebody's garage. Now if you uh, had a look at that video, you'll know that I actually had to look at these records via torchlight because there were no lights in the garage. Um, so this is probably the first time I'm really getting a close look. So I pulled some out and let's have a look. Uh, the first one is the Who By Numbers. It's the sleeve with the dot to dots on it. Um, conditioner sleeves not too bad but it does have some uh, edge wear on the spine there. Um, rear of the sleeve, there is a dink at the top um, and it's a little grubby but uh, not too bad. Um, on the Polydor label and it is the sleeve with the limited edition number in the bottom left hand corner. Now uh, this is the uh, red Polydor label dated 1975. Uh, conditioner vinyl is actually really really nice. It is definitely a VG plus, possibly a near mint. Really nice and glossy. That's a nice album. The Who by Numbers. Uh, next up is the Beach Boys Pet Sounds. Um, sleeve on this one, not too bad. Does have a crease top right and there is a crease bottom left. Uh, this is the uh, mono pressing. Uh, it's a capital and EMI record. Um, comes in the flip back laminated Garrett and Lofthouse sleeve and this one's dated 1966. Now this is a UK pressing, uh, it does say sold in the UK subject to resale um, but the condition of this isn't that great, it probably is only a VG, uh, yeah I'd say it's a VG, the, uh, there's a fair amount of wear and tear on that one. That's the Beach Boys Pet Sounds. Uh, next up is Gong, Flying Teapot. This sleeve is uh, really nice. Uh, very slight edge wear on the top or top edge wear there. Um, I would still say it's a VG plus sleeve. It is the uh, gatefold sleeve with all the uh, gump inside that you can have a read of. Um, Virgin Records on the rear. Catalogue number is OVED14. Um, let's have a look at the vinyl. It's the green and red Virgin label. Vinyl and this one is immaculate, that is pristine, that is really glossy, really shiny, that is definitely a near mint vinyl on that one. That's gone. Uh, next one up is The Further You Look, John Holt. Uh, sleeves not too bad, a little bit of wear on the corner there. Um, some stains on this side on the rear. It is a stereo LP and this one is on the uh, classic Trojan Records label. Now I can't see a date on this label, so it's possibly a slightly later press, not the original. Um, vinyl condition, not the best, does have a few marks on that side. Um, although generally it's, it's fairly glossy, that's probably a VG on that one. That's John Holt. Uh, and then this one is Johnny Rivers and his LA Boogie Band. Sleeve's probably the worst on this one. Bit of ring wear, edge wear, spine wear but it is on the uh, gatefold sleeve. Uh, this one says Gothic Print Finishers Limited, London South East 9 on the inside. So it's probably a British sleeve, although I do think the LP is actually French. Um, and interestingly enough, this one is actually on a white label. Um, it's not often you see white labels in picture sleeves, but this one is a white label. Um, condition of the vinyl, not so good on this one, only a VG. Um, but I did check the catalogue number, it is the correct vinyl for this, this sleeve, so um, yeah, white label, interesting to find that. So that's a few from the collection. Uh, there are plenty more, but I'm not going to go through those now. Um, maybe I'll do some more videos, but I do intend to do more videos of uh, some more of my pickups um, as I get more stuff. So um, thanks for watching, stay tuned, and I'll see you soon.